I'm with all the Caucasian friends here. Okay. So what are you taking with you? So you need to catch your own food, no? So I catch this pineapple, that's it. So that will be our lunch for, that, that, for today. For today anyway, I'm diet. On diet. <laughs> so what are you catch? I'm catching the... Uh, <laughs> the live jacket. Live jacket. <laughs> have a day off and we will be staying here for the next three days technically we're staying in this beautiful hotel with a great view from our balcony today is also our first day here and though it's still middle of the day we also need to catch some sleep after a long flight we plan to have dinner together tonight about sunset time so I better get some sleep now. I force myself to wake up at around 3 in the afternoon so I can sleep in the night. Shortly, I will be meeting the crew and have some dinner in a local restaurant. The second day is the day of the tour. And there's about eight of us, including the flight crew. It's going to be a one day full of fun. And if you've been with me for a long time, I normally go out by myself. But this time will be different. As I think it will be more fun to explore this beautiful destination when you are in a group. Plus, you get a free tripod. No, I'm just kidding. thought we have a hidden gem in this part of the world and I'm so glad I've requested for this destination. Welcome to Zanzibar! Well actually they gave me two of my requested flights which I am so grateful for. This time we are heading to watch and swim with the dolphins. guys went to swim with these amazing creatures and the girls just decided to watch. Well, the truth is, I am just so scared to swim in a deep sea. After that, we decided to go to an island while of course chilling and drinking with a crew. Yeah. It's so nice to just dip your feet in the sea. It just feels so relaxing and refreshing at the same time. It's another day to enjoy and have fun. And I'm so glad I went with a tour. This is the island and I can't believe my eyes that there's not much of people here. Well, actually, maybe I'm just not used to seeing a lot of people traveling before. That's why I'm being amazed to the things I'm seeing now. It'd probably be a bit insensitive to say this, but I guess now is the best time to explore new places. We're doing a vlog, but we need to, we are going to do a vlog as well. I'm with all the Caucasian friends here. Okay. It's going to be my assessment. <laughs> so, I would like to know. <laughs> no, it's a surprise, of course. So I'm here with my Bosnian 
Yeah. I'm having my assessment and I should exceed expectations, that's all. That's Excuse all. me, are you demanding me? <laughs> no! Hello, welcome to Zanzibar! Oh, I can't believe I'm experiencing this paradise now. The white sand, clear water, and the perfect weather of course. With some colorful fish. This time we're going for some snorkeling with these creatures. But first, let me test the water. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Let me just prepare myself so I can see them clearly down below. I'm so grateful to fly with really nice pilots and amazing set of crew. No drama, just pure. We are also fortunate enough that we have found a jolly tour guide. They even perform in front of us. Now it's time for some yum yum as what they say here. It's already been around 2 in the afternoon that we had our lunch. We were also surprised to see our lunch for today as it looks really fresh and appetizing. After a delicious meal, we headed to another tourist place but of course, our tour guide wanted us to have some refreshments on our way to the turtle place. This man is preparing our coconut drink for us. Hello babies! So this is a turtle aquarium where you get to swim with these cute creatures. I was a bit scared as well though they don't really bite at all as they are vegetarian but because they are so huge and they really want to get close to you. This is probably the funniest encounter that I had with the turtles. We are finally ending the day here at the Sunset Beach. And I would say it's one of the most beautiful sunsets I've ever witnessed. And just listening to the waves makes me feel so calm and relaxed. I wish we could stay here longer though. If only I knew I could have booked a room here for $50. I also wish my husband was here so we could share this experience together. The sad part of this job is that you don't really get to have your special someone to share your travels with you. But I'm not complaining. I'm still thankful that I'm able to experience it in this lifetime. Life is short and nobody knows what the future brings. So might as well enjoy whatever we currently have because the next time you know it, it probably be too late. Today is our last day here in Zanzibar and I couldn't be so grateful for the experience here. I'm also not feeling so bad because I will be coming back in the next day again. And by then, I will explore a different paradise. This place is a real beauty. I'm just enjoying my cup of coffee while reading my book and watching the view from the balcony. I hope you guys enjoyed my vlog as much as I did. 
and I shall see you again on my next adventure. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and thanks for watching. Bye for now.